winners anymore. Oh, yeah, yeah. Well, you're right. Yeah. Um, Levin's doing the like, laser one, which is obviously more difficult, but you can tell he's practiced it a hell of a lot more. Mm. And so it was nice to see Brad just go for the thing that's guaranteed, even though, you know, he could probably do something much more technical. It's like, hey, this is a 2-1 set, and I have a chance to win it right now. Let me take that fucking win. Oh, no. Uh, let's not do that. We, uh... Oh, Jesus. Nang, no, there's so many nags. All right, we found, found them. <laughs> I'm guessing this is... Oh, yep. Yeah. Got to think. Catherine is PhD. Actually, all right. I guess I'm solo coming for a bit. Should probably put in scores, hey, or like the rest of the bracket. But I don't think anyone else could do that. All right. Now playing Peach Samus. Everyone, celebrate now. Oh, that shield broke. It's nasty. I'm gonna assume that Caleb McLeod was too hard. I don't think anyone in. Let's go over that. Alright, so I think last time they played this matchup, Catherine won a game three set. So, it'll be interesting now they got the best of five going. Let's see what. Up happening. Uh, Catherine's got a big lead, actually. <laughs> yeah, that's the right thing to do. Catherine wasn't ready for it, and kind of just have to deal with that one. Interesting up air idea. Oh, he drifts forwards. No. Just hit the knee, you fool. Unfortunately, up being damn near everything, so. It's time to come back. Actually, uh, for the start that Catherine had, she needs to get a hit. It's a very one sided. Right now. Also, if Ruby could scar jump. They come in real handy against the Peach floating at heights. Catherine's currently doing to recover. Yeah, you gotta up air that. You know Peach is gonna mix up coming down with down air, nothing. Yeah, you're all good. Peach is the sort of character you just gotta keep it simple with. Like, take your free hits when you get your free hits, because like if you could put her in a bad spot, she can't get out of it very easily. So if you could just keep doing it. Yeah. Good gentleman. Honestly, he's shocked that he can hit gentlemen somewhat consistently. I don't know why. I don't think it's that hard of a tech. It's just the fact that he doesn't main Falcon that it surprises me. Yeah. What we got? Yeah. Yeah, good DI mix up there from Catherine. Good DI eyeing out on everything so far. Yeah, in spots like that, he really needs to just up air. Like, if he just could have died here up air, he might as well go for it. Yeah. That yeah, was one too many DI ends. Just 
yeah, you can react to the up B, but if you uh, down throw knee. But if you're not used to the other guy going in, then out, then in, then out, it is reasonably difficult. Like, obviously, at top level, you don't even notice it, but at mid level, it's kind of important. Alright, Kazan from Texas Game 1. Interesting. So I'm assuming that Ruben's going to, yeah, just go to stadium and try to win game two. I don't know, I, I get the feeling Ruben just needs to sit down on a setup with Quetz for eight hours and just figure out what he's doing wrong against this character. Because it doesn't seem to matter which Peach at the moment he ends up playing. Just way worse at it, yeah. Catherine did the right drift there. Recognize she got up it last time, drifts back, gets an air for it. Still loses stock, but not related to previous mistakes. Good to see her learning from. Alright, yeah, that was a really good up air. Oh, went for it again. Interesting, yeah, Peach is a wall of hitboxes, and therefore, Side B never hits her. Also, hard to get her to grounded in a spot where you can Side B as a tech chase, so. Yeah, you do not want to be doing that against Peach. Good tech, though. He knew what he had to do. Kick grab. <laughs> Look at this buck grab I've ever seen in my life. It was just the fact that Peach was so ready to forward throw him up, and it's. Yeah, bad drift. You gotta. You can't just go at Falcon like that. He's going to need you for it. Or up air, or do something. That's it, you can't really do a whole lot about it. Beach. Clutch up tilt from Beach, I never thought I'd say that. So that the cloud peach combo again three and grab it's good, so. Yeah, down, down throw knee definitely kills people. That might have been a percent where it was just better to hold in and hope the dude doesn't get the reverse. Because I think she might have lived otherwise. But it's like such a hard thing to know in the moment. To like tell yourself, hey, get need here. Toad is not a good move. Parasol, on the other hand, is a very good move. Just when it comes to recovering. Good forward tilt. Watch his edge guard, though. Pretty sure that was a grab ledge and then 50 50 back air mix up in a spot. Actually, at that height, it might have just been, yeah. Pretty sure he could just back air those for free and there's no amount of drift and up B angle. Hang on, whatnot that Peach can do there. Gotta go from higher, I think, to really force a mix up. Alright, we got a fight. Stands to reason. Oh no. Captain's getting Jade. Yeah, highly recommend looking up the trailer for Don't Get Jade if you just want to watch a man get stomped a bunch. And if you can put up with American History X. That was good up air timing. <laughs> uh. Yeah. I don't know what he was going for there. Because he threw out knee as well, which wouldn't have done anything to get him. So I don't know what was going on. I guess he wanted to back air. Well, like double jump back air. He obviously wanted to double jump. Alright, platform. That was a really good up air from Gath. Yeah, it's just a shame that it pushed him off the platform. I guess the double jump land down smash would have been the, the play then. 
try to punish him for falling off the platform. Yeah, Nene. Can't be stopped. Can't jab reset peach like that. They get to just hold it up on this gray stick and get out. Actually, I don't even know if they have to do that. I don't know what Ribbon's doing there. Man needs to know how to learn how to recover. He's hitting the buttons and up at the same time. Alright, Catherine's got to be in a really good spot here. He gets out, but he comes quick, 44, and he's back in. Uh, is that going to do it? Yeah. All right, Captain takes game three. Interesting. Catherine, one game away from taking the set. Right. Where are we going? Battlefield's a good choice. I feel like Dreamland seems counterintuitive, but like the way he's getting knees at 100, it'd be fine. He wanted to do it. Man, did he want to do it. Probably could have neared or up in there and been fine. Yeah. Oh, it faded. Thought you were going to get need and therefore die anyway. Yeah. Right. Pull up. Interesting. I don't know how I feel about that. Just because I don't know how that would have interacted had he get up attack. So if that beats get up attack, it's a good option, but otherwise it's pretty inferior to jump jump landing on the platform. Ruin really likes the near. Uh, let's up near with Falcon. I don't know how I feel about it. Feels like it should be getting punished more than it is, but at the same time, I'm like, what else is Falcon supposed to do? Yeah, that's not going to kill, but he's fairly close, yeah. I like the idea from Ruben there, he just didn't commit to it hard enough, which is like a hard mindset to get into. Particularly coming from Samus, it's like probably the biggest difference is the way they edge guard. Like, Samus just doesn't go off stage. She sits there and she. Up tilts and forward tilt stuff and shoots missiles and whatnot. Falcon just goes out there. Falcon, if you want to die dead, you have to go out there and hit him. So, like, it's understandable why he's like not as comfortable committing to offstage options. Back, yeah. Yeah, that's the sort of stuff you do against Peach a lot more. Is bait like you're going to go for something and then drift back and waste your float. Oh, that so, sucks so bad. Catherine's all over him this dog. God damn. Just like, has his timing unlocked. Yeah. Catherine air dodging way too high. Yeah, Ruben needs a big combo. And he's gonna get near hit. It's not a big combo. Uh, that sucks. I think he's gonna get grabbed and then get hit for trying to do the thing that beats that. Even though they did try to grab you. What's he got? Yeah. Kevin just kind of waited for that. Makes sense, like that also covers the nair from the ledge, so it's like, why would you not? I wonder if he was going for up air, I hope he was. Sometimes fucking up air just gets clipped like that. Yeah, that's a good back air, there you go. Alright, so Ruben's still in this, he just needs 
One good hit and it's an even game. So Catherine does not look like she's going to just lie down and give him an easy hit. Yep, good recovery. Oh yeah, you can't be doing that against Peach. You gotta know. Push there. Right. Oh no, drops it. And now they're both scared. Yeah, good up air. Are you gonna get this? Dropped it, but it's fine. Yeah, good up air. Back on it. Oh, uh, nah, but he doesn't get the second hit, so still play neutral. What's he got? Oh! And Catherine wins. I don't think she would have died there, but she might have. Big DBZ to win the set. Damn. Okay. That's an upset. Ruben really needs to find something for Peach. Oh, goddamn. Alright, so I assume we got musket versus...